So I'm going to paste it here. Uh, paste it here, and we're gonna take a look at how it works. All right. And then, well, at the same time, actually, we need to say offset because whether this works or not, we don't know how it's gonna work. So I'm gonna put it here, and then I'm going to say that position dot max scroll events. All right. Okay. Now over here we'd say max scroll extent actually like this so let's get going and understand now this is the time that we go ahead and restart it one more time so that it works well so let's gonna wait for it and here we go uh, let's go to the author page right and let's click on this amazing you see offset is zero max scroll extent is zero so in this case initially they're both zero now one of the things that max offset does over here which you should be actually um write down okay all right uh, i'm going to say it so offset starts as you scroll so scroll offset offset tells you how much you scroll that's it that's what the offset does also tells you how much you scroll and how much you uh, i mean as you scroll it starts it all right now of course if i save it but anyway most probably if i scroll right now we'll see nothing okay it's not printing but of course to be able to print this information actually we should be putting it inside the listener okay we should we have to do that so I'm gonna cut this. But why I put it at the beginning just now, because to let you know that offset starts from zero, max scroll starts from zero as well, okay? All right, so over here, offset starts from zero, uh, max scroll extent, scroll extent starts from zero. Now why I'm being so uh, delicate and trying to explain this and because this scrolling thing most people don't understand how it works a lot of them eventually you might think understanding the block is easy but the scrolling and how everything works uh, a lot of people don't understand so that's why I want you to take notes as well because after now and a few months later a few weeks later when you look at the code you might be completely forgetting why and how it works okay now over here, I would also say until you until you start scrolling. Now this might be very confusing. I'm gonna walk you through that. What I mean by that? Okay, let's see if we can actually restore everything over here. Now I'm going to look at this one and I'm going to click on this. All right. Of course, this message is gone. Now let's do that. Awesome. And here we do see that we have some information. Let's look at them carefully. Well, offset is one. And here max scroll instant has a value. This is cool. And the value itself over here you'll see that is like uh, 68. And what the hell is this? Or what the heck is this? I'm sorry. Sorry for my language. And as you see, at the same time, as you're scrolling, as we are scrolling, offset one, it's, it's the value increases. Well, of course, I don't know, it's jumped to three, and then three, 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 and four. So one thing, as I said earlier, offset is something that actually, uh, as you scroll, it starts to print. So that, that tells you actually, offset itself, this is the value tells you how much you have scrolled down from the bottom, uh, from the top, okay? how much you have scrolled so the total pixel you have scrolled on this page that's what you have to know okay once again you have to make sure that you have this scrolling attached otherwise it's just not gonna work it's very important so remember offset tells you that how much you have scrolled down uh, from the top that's it it starts from the zero which means that you didn't scroll and as soon as you start to scroll down it tells you okay how much you have scrolled that's it now what is this max scroll in extent thing then wow this is cool very cool and as you see as we are scrolling it's keeping a persistent value 
oh so this is amazing right but of course we do also see that it is changing because we are uh, losing it and it's, so we are releasing it so it goes back up so in that case the offset itself changes as well as you see over here well it is 13 14 14 15 16 17 and uh, well uh, let's save it let's save it let's see how it goes all right now let's scroll 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 all right over here now this time we'll have a better data so well we we have been okay somehow we started from 18 before that the messages didn't get print but it doesn't matter because i think somehow it got locked now as you see offset is increasing 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 a lot because we are coming down to this screen and 52 55 58 offset 61 62 73 80 100 153 all right so as as we are scrolling down because we scroll down a lot actually so it was just increasing and uh, so it's, it's increasing but of course max scrolling extent is also increasing at the same time so as you scroll so both of the values they just uh, get increased okay now over here you see that it start to decrease in this position because at that moment I came down up to here so I scrolled a lot on the screen okay and then when I released this offset is going back because scrolling is over now it started to go up all right so it tells you that it starts from somewhere zero at the top or somewhere here it could be a bar as well I don't know exactly most probably the app bar anyway so now when you release it it goes back to the app bar so offset gets to become smaller so that tells you that okay the offset itself is uh, I mean becoming smaller which means that I'm going up which also means that I released it right okay cool and uh, well of course this itself is another story the max scrolling extent all right so now scroll offset this one we have this understanding so as you scroll it increases as you release the scroll it decreases or it goes back to zero and that's it does okay and you have to know this one cool all right now let me restart it one more time before we continue further so if you have any question just leave a question below I'd love to help you to answer with this all right okay because a lot of time if you don't understand scrolling your chatting just doesn't work it would be a disaster trust me scrolling is very important for your uh, chatting and this is the reason actually I'm spending a lot more time over here anyway Okay, so what does this tell you right now? Uh, let us see one more time. It would be beautiful if we see it. Okay, so I'm gonna start scrolling from here. I started, all right. Okay, so 68. And what is the 68? Awesome. This 68 tells you that, okay, well, this is a list, right? This list is saved inside my block over here. Uh, this block list over here, right? Now, this list itself is the complete list. Remember, uh, we have seen early that uh, over here, we are getting first 15 data, right? But not all the data is on the screen. Okay, not all the data is on the screen. So there are some of the data, maybe three or four data. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 we are so lucky there's one more data at the top which we don't see so it would be over here so this this is the actually the pretty much the length between these two okay so little length between these two so there is another hidden how much is hidden 68 68 pixel is at the top but of course how it is counting let me tell you how it back to our list over here this list itself is holding the 15 items this uh, 15 items right now it, it is taking that 15 item and then at the same time it's checking the length of this 15 item so 15 item is pretty much the whole screen length okay it's pretty much the whole screen length now but it was just only able to show how many 14 of them so there is one hidden okay so that's how it gets this length over here that why this that has to be 16 okay so 
in our list over here this one itself over here has 15 data and it already showed on the screen 14 of them and there is another was hidden and that hidden length or value is 68 awesome so that's how it works now well we could do another thing so we were looking up 15 of them now i'm going to look up say over here 16 16 data all right so let's restart everything and we'll see how it goes let's go ahead and look at this thing because this is getting awesome because you have to understand if your chatting has to be uh, work correctly as well as the scrolling itself has to work correctly right so for nothing but let me hit it a little bit oh cool now here you see okay uh, over here I have 119 remember just now we had 68 what's the double of 68 is almost uh, more than 120 right so now there is two data hidden at the top so the pretty much the length is around 120 and that's what we get over here so what it does max scroll content how it works well it takes the whole list and it tries to fit as many as possible on the screen itself now for that one it counts a lot of things one of the thing it counts is your padding like like over here if you have padding or margin it takes everything into consideration and then see how many it could fit on the screen all right and rest of them the one that are not visible on the screen that is given to this max scroll extent so that means that actually uh this scroll controller over here this one it can know well how many you first took first time and then based on that what's the total length of that list in terms of pixels remember and now it's counting 16 item what's the length on the screen itself okay based on a pixel value and it shows the number of items it can show because the screen could be long or small and then rest of the the one that is not shown because we have another two that's not shown those value in terms of pixels is given to this max scroll all right so there is another like 120 pixels that's hidden it means another two item that's it and that's how max scroll extent works okay one more time max scroll ex extent takes the value of the number of hidden items the length in terms of pixel value and that's it and that's what we compare over here all right so because it starts from zero and now well i'm scrolling down i'm scrolling when i like remember when i scroll little more than well of course you don't have to keep it 10 it doesn't really matter uh so what i'm going to do i'm gonna go back to 15 so that uh, it is more easy to understand because if the number gets bigger it might not be uh, that comprehensible the way the thing that we are trying to understand all right so let's come over here all right now let's see okay so what's gonna happen over here with this condition well if i start to scroll you'll see that this value increases and then the hidden item we also compare now we know that max scroll extent will have a value the value would be pretty much the length that is hidden so this amount so which means that if i'm scrolling this amount and once that's done okay this is the time that means that i have already shown the hidden data as well that means that i should be loading this one and that's as simple as that and this is the reason that why we actually do this conditional check because you have to check how much is hidden and how much you have climbed down from the top and not only climbed down whether you have exceed this value whether you have surpassed this value whether you have climbed down more than this value and if you did go ahead and scroll that's it that's as beautiful as this one i mean i think i've tried my best to explain and you should be understanding and if you even after that if you don't understand this thing so go ahead and check the link below i have a written format of this which might may be more comprehensible for most people so anyway the condition tells you that okay 
I'm going to scroll down first as I scroll down I'm going to count this one and the value scrolling value if more than the hidden length pixel value then it means that go ahead and show this more loading thing which means keep loading beautiful I'm happy I'm happy with the explanation because I think I tried my best if you guys still don't understand keep asking me questions on this I'm gonna to try to explain and once again if you don't understand go through the video again because as you do chatting the scrolling thing I tell you very important a lot of people they don't understand they make a lot of mistakes all right okay anyway and if you did understand don't forget to give me thumbs up five star rating and five star rating which would help me to make the course even better or whatever courses I'm do because I try my best to explain things as I code all right thank you so I'll see you in next session